mainstream education radar? Besides being a politician, I am also an educationalist. So it's a topic of my interest. Yes. So I will just request you to give me some time first to discuss about the problems, challenges, and what government is doing. And in the next, next second half, we will discuss in detail about what government is doing. See, this is a gap between demographics and regions. And it uh, covers uh, communication, urban ruler distinction, then there is a regional divide and also gender divide of which people are not talking about. Government has done several efforts uh, and has also succeeded to a large extent, but still a lot of work has to be done. See, the measures which has been taken by government is like Bharat Next Project, Digital Literacy Mission, Digital Sakshartha Abhiyan, Digital India Campaign, Pradhan Mantri Gramin uh, Sakshartha, Digital Sakshartha Abhiyan, Kisan Call Center, Digital Library of India, all these things cover, are covered under to cover the digital divide. But there are great challenges. And challenges they include the lack of infrastructure. India is a densely populated country. India needs well-established infrastructure to deliver e-services. Government is definitely working upon that, but a lot of work has to be done still. Then there is a huge population, and it is a big challenge for a developing country to serve a very big population, second largest in the world. Then there is a geographical diversity. Rural India is still deprived of facilities of the urban India because of the geographical location. Then there is poverty. A large part of population is fighting for its daily basic needs. They do not bother about high-speed devices and gadgets for digitalization. The literacy is also an issue because people who are less literate cannot operate properly the digital devices. And in some states, especially uh, in South India, I am uh, uh, telling you very frankly, uh, there is also an issue of corruption. So the budget which is being allocated by the union government doesn't reach on time. So these all things are there and government is uh, doing its best to take color. And uh, various states have also done various things. But I will say, and I don't hesitate to say, that a lot of work needs to be done. And uh, there are other challenges, social challenges also coming. Mm -hmm. like, uh, Many, many of the children, uh, the, especially the boys, are being uh, uh, sent to the fields uh, or how family shops, uh, and they are working there. You can't say that they are working as a child labor, but they are working in the family setup, and girls are usually used for the household help uh, besides uh, the, the child marriages. So these all issues have also emerged, and uh, you know, the 90s was were the times when we were trying for universal enrollments in schools. Then, past decade we spent in uh, in uplifting our educational standards. But whatever we have achieved had got a big blow due to COVID-19, and now we are again struggling. And we, I am sure that we we will be do, able to do it. We are struggling, but we will uh, achieve. Um, okay, Dr. Gul.